The Heavenly Strike. There is a musician in Komatsu telling the tale of Shigenori's Heavenly Strike. I thought that katana technique was a myth, but maybe I should hear him... out. Oh. Hey, yeah, this sounds pretty interesting. And there's a whole bunch of other ones, too, that we have yet to find. I'm guessing we find these by figuring out the right person to talk to who will tell me about it. Or by randomly coming across a location. For Tsushima. There are some in Azamo who want to fight back against the Mongols, but they are not samurai and will only endanger their lives. Yup. The Valley of Sake. The Mongols are attacking the key sake brewery in Azamo. Right, so you can kind of look at the rewards and see, and try to guess, I guess, if, um, if the quest is considered something really big. These ones are probably just random stuff. We'll probably eventually get to it because we gotta get down to the blacksmith anyway. Right now, though, I'm really curious about this one. Oh, I didn't even put a thing on it. Can I? Mm-hmm. The Heavenly Strike. Sounds interesting. Here. Let's go, Nobu. Making good use of this daylight. Oh, we haven't found any records and stuff for a while. I wonder if I should be putting on the Traveler's attire again. <laughs> Maybe once I upgrade it some more. I feel like being able to wear something that's not very heavily armored is a sign that you're really, really skilled as a samurai, right? Because you don't need that extra armor to protect you. Mm -hmm. We're kind of going a different way here, but I think it's okay if we eventually wrap back around. Actually, we might not go around. Maybe let's get down. Yeah, around here might be a better bet. Oh! Oh no! Oh, you're fast, Nobu. Oh! Komatsu Prefecture. Our first time being here. Does it look different? Not really. Komatsu Forge. We're looking for a Shigenori. Hey. This ain't it. Whoa, this guy's got a bird! What's going on? Ah! Ah! Birdie! Oh my god! These guys seem a little bit different. Oh yeah, these guys have double sword attacks. Oh yeah. I keep rolling too far away in Stings at Blade. That's why I don't really like rolling. I think it's just something I gotta get used to. Ooh. No legend increase. Doesn't happen every time, I guess. Oh! You're going to be alright. Can you get somewhere safe? I think so, my lord. But the Mongols are watching from the crossroads above the river. Anyone traveling north from Azamo is in danger. I'll see to the Mongols. There we go. Okay, good luck, my man. That's probably another place that we can look into in due time. But right now, Shigenori is my man.
Is that a camp over there? Yes. Susano, protect me. Oh, Shigenori's technique. Dead bodies. But Yamato is the the musician who sings about that technique. What happened here? Who killed these people? A fearsome warrior. He demanded I tell him the tale of Shigenori's heavenly strike. When he didn't hear the answers he sought, he flew into a rage and butchered them. What did he want to know? I am not sure, my lord. Tell me the story. I need to know what he's after. When Tsushima was first settled, a strange and terrible thunderstorm swept across our island. Wherever lightning struck, beasts of lightning appeared. These violent creatures tore through villages, causing death and destruction, moving too quickly to be stopped. The people knew only one man who could possibly stand against the lightning beasts. Shigenori, the fastest swordsman in all of Tsushima. Shigenori never lost a duel. With years of practice, he had created the Heavenly Strike, an attack that struck quicker than the eye could follow. Shigenori lured the creatures to a desolate beach in Komatsu, where the sand would slow their movement. Their clash turned the sand to ash and bleached the leaves of trees white. Shigenori's heavenly strike cut through them faster than they could move. As the final beast fell, the storm cleared and Tsushima was safe again. Shigenori began a life of seclusion. Few students found him, and only the bravest and most skilled proved worthy of learning the heavenly strike. When a storm approaches, a sword is placed at Shigenori's rest by a student who knows of its location to ward off attacks from beasts of nature. Wow. The murderer wishes to learn Shigenori's heavenly strike. It sounds dangerous in the wrong hands. Which way did he go? A woman fled toward a nearby bridge. He chased her. He'll answer for what he did here. Oh, this is new. Learning a new technique, the Heavenly Strike. These guys weren't even bandits, they were just random people. Keep playing that. Oh. Fancy. This sounds like such a legendary technique. That's the bridge the musician mentioned. And a woman? Someone weeping. Where? <gasps> My lord, so many. He's slaughtered. Did you see the man who killed them? I know who he is. Yasuhira Koga. I've heard the name. He fought for the Yarikoa clan. Would you recognize him? I'll never forget that leering face. Follow me. Perhaps I can pick up his trail on the other side of the bridge. Follow? You want to bring her with you? Seems kind of dangerous. Tracks. Yasuhira was in a hurry. Two can play at that. What more do you know of Yasuhira Koga? Only that he was a retainer for the Yarikawa clan years ago. After the rebellion was crushed, the clan was dissolved and retainers dismissed. Rumor says he left Tsushima, but when the Mongols attacked, he returned. From where, I'm not sure. It doesn't matter. He cannot be allowed to live after what he's done. I thought the villager was gonna climb on my horse. 
I feel like owning a horse is kind of a status symbol, but maybe not. But this guy, he doesn't know where the Heavenly Strike is, right? That's why he got mad and killed the people. Up ahead. They're constructing a roadblock. Even if we get him now, it doesn't guarantee that we'll find out where Heavenly Strike is. But maybe that musician will be impressed enough to let me know. Mongols, hide yourself. Forgive me, uncle, for I will sin. Even just one might be better than nothing. You're looking right at the thing, though. Ah! Ah! Okay. Didn't even get the standoff. Hey. One at a time. Oh, sword from a distance. I can parry that now! These double sword guys are a bit annoying. Oh! They don't attack me because they're waiting for the arrow to hit. That it? gonna keep farming oh two can play at that this is a random village that they took over we're pursuing a man named Yasuhira Koga he just left he's been staying in the watchtower working with the Mongols Yes, but last night they argued. Only made out one word. Chigenori. I'll search the watchtower. Find somewhere safe before more Mongols come. They're still trying to figure out where the Heavenly Strike is. So I'm guessing that's some kind of a Mongol symbol then. What has Yasuhira been doing? Trying to find the Heavenly Strike? Just a guess. Oh, we're in Kashina now. Is it below me? There's nothing on this floor. Oh! White leaves, like those bleached by lightning in the tail. The Mongols have their own version of Shigenori's tale. Maybe he wanted to compare it to the musician's version. Hey, Jin, when did you learn to read Mongolian? I'm not sure if that's Mongolian, though. <laughs> A dueling ring. He's looking for it. Dueling ring. Yasuhira is looking for someone who can teach him Shigenori's heavenly strike. The white leaves. There are trees like that not far from here. That's where he went. You've helped enough. Get to safety with the others. Thank you, my lord. I hope you punish that monster. Yeah, I'll try my best. Need to find white-leafed trees. Can I ride any random horse, by the way, even if it's not Nobu? I guess so. This way. Let's go. Thank you. 
The white leaf tree. Is there only one? Plum Blossom Shrine. Ah! The Tory Gates. My lord. This path is dangerous. The Tory Gates led me to a shrine. Hey. These Tory Gates lead to the Plum Blossom Shrine. Sanctuary of the Kagutsuji. Kamiya Fire. for a samurai, but not a priestess. What are you doing here? My duty, tending the shrines. When the war ends, people will need these Torii gates to mark their path, so they can find the Shinto shrines and pray for the Kami's protection. We could use their protection now. Yes, but the paths are too treacherous. I tried to visit the nearby shrine, almost fell to my death. Maybe I can reach it. As a boy, I climbed every tree and cliff around my village. If you get there in one piece, pray for our island, and take an Omamori charm for yourself. Wear it close, and the charm will change your fate. And perhaps the fate of our home. Thank you. Omamori literally means protection. Follow the Torii gates. They will lead you to shrines all across our island, and the Omamori charms that rest there. If you go to shrines in Japan, you can see that they sell these pretty often to tourists and stuff. Okay, that's nice and all, but I'm looking for... Oh, do you think the tree... No, the tree is probably not related to the shrine. Uh, but we're here right now. We're here right now. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. What's it gonna be? Parkour? Almost falling to her death. So I'm guessing it's not a combat kind of difficulty. Okay. That doesn't seem to be... Can I go around here? Hey. Ah, okay. I think it is parkour then. Which... Oh dear. Why is there a random fire burning like that? Oh my goodness. That is insane. Oh, but there's some bamboos over there, but I don't want to fall down. You are agile, Jin. Um... This is okay. Oh, oh. Oh, gosh. Oh, my goodness. You're better than Nathan Drake. Komatsu? That's the name of the area, the prefecture we're in, right? Yeah. We made it! Oh, the tree's right there! Perfect. Charm of the Kami of Fire. Charm of Kagutsuchi. Bonus damage while at 50% health or less. It says Komatsu on the plaque. Uh, I don't know if I want to have 50% health or less though. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like I'd rather have moderately reduces damage. I'm okay for now. I need more slots, that's what. Oh, there's some stuff here. Flowers! Thank you. Alright. Well, I prayed for us. Hopefully we're gonna be okay. 
That's the exact tree we were looking for, right? Oh, good thing I didn't go off and look for it. It's right here. <gasps> My goodness. Okay. Shigenori's peak. Yasuhira must have gathered leaves from here. There it is. White leaves, like those bleached by lightning in the tail. That's where we have to go. But we can't go down here. We have to find a way down. Which turned out to be easy enough. Oh, I think. I think. Okay. What do we hope to find, though? A scroll? A book? That'll tell us about the technique? Because Shigenori himself probably is dead, right? I'm guessing the tale happened a long time ago. I'm guessing what we gotta do is probably fight the guy and then somehow- OW! Predators! Predators! Somehow we're gonna learn the Heavenly Strike after we fight Yasuhira Koga. Perfect weather to be having a duel right now. Stop! I told him everything I know! Someone's being tortured. We don't want to alert everybody, do we? Negium Hashi! Stop! I told him everything I know! Stop! Oh, pretty cruel. Finally, we're getting to use this. Oh, there's a lot of people. Wait, there's way more people than I thought there were. That's a lot! Somehow I got to the prisoner without coming across any of them. No longer. That guy just shot his friend in the back. Huh? Ow! Get him! Right in the back. I feel like I should switch back to the stone stance for a little bit just to see what I'm missing out on. Oh! Hey! Here we go. <laughs> Met it? Wow, you guys had a very, very bad defense going on here. Somehow I managed to sneak inside, but there were 50 people outside who didn't see me. Kidding? They're still close. Wow! <laughs> Are you kidding? What kind of tone is that? I came to rescue you. Gosh. Oh, hey. 
फिर निकाल ली ओह वाटर सेंस नो 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 नॉट द कैमरा जंप करा तू जो है ना I got a Please. Oh. <laughs> calm down, calm down. Oh, there's even an archer in the back. Yeah, peasant. Are you happy now? I got everybody. Help. Now you want help? Now you want help? Fine. It was a man named Yasuhiro with these Mongols. Mm. He wanted to learn the heavenly strike from my grandfather and took him away. Your grandfather's in danger. Where did they go? His old training ground. A dueling ring on the Komatsu coast. Please. Oh, we got to do all. Save him. Whoa. What the heck? What just happened? Oh, we got a duel for sure. Let's not have it be bad weather, though. The rain won't stop. Yasuhira cannot learn the heavenly strike. So that guy's grandpa. He's the one who knows how to get it. Oh, it's thunder and lightning. Maybe we can't change it right now because they want us to do the duel in this bad weather on purpose. Fair enough. Okay. Okay. We'll get him. He's got to be around here. Oh dear. Oh dear. So put that tree down in order to cross. Cuz the bridge broke. Oh. This tree right here. Yasuhira brought Mongols with him. It's really helpful that we can assassinate the shield guys. Because these guys take forever. This is how we win. I don't know. Do you feel good about that? But if we're preparing for a duel, we need to have full resolve, full health, all that good stuff. Yet another Japanese working with the Mongols. That's sad. I get that some of them just want to survive. Maybe that's why they're doing this. But some people like Tomoe. Maybe they're just doing it because they want to. All right, we're close. That must be Shigenori's dueling ring. What has Yasuhira been doing? Oh no. Poor man. Killed by Yasuhira. This weather. Blade has seen many duels. 
The story said the students put a sword at the spot where Shigenori's resting. Footprints. Still fresh. Yasuhira Kuga, the butcher of the rebellion. Time hasn't changed you. You were a child when Yarikawa burned, boy. A samurai. For 15 years, I dreamed of cutting Lord Shimura to the bone. You won't live long enough to face him. The old man taught me the legendary attack before I killed him. Let me show you. Oh, that was the grandpa. Things are burning. Oh God. You don't have a shield. I'm not afraid of you. He's fast. He is fast. What are you waiting for, boy? Not waiting. Studying. Learning. He's very fast. Actually. Oh, I'm done. Oh. <laughs> Lord Shimura should have taught you better. Ah, oh, that was so close. The fires are gone! They're back! He is so fast! What are you waiting for, boy? Not waiting. Studying. Learning. Oh, I'm doing a lot better this time. I've got it. Oh! The heavenly strike couldn't save you. Oh! The fires and stuff and the lightning. That's supposed to be the heavenly strike. And we learned it by facing him. Yeah, we're not burying this guy. Wow, that's insane. I wonder how often we can do that. You deserve greater respect than this. That guy might have been the last person on Earth to know about the Heavenly Strike. I promise I'll use Shigenori's technique to protect Tsushima against all who would harm it. Very good. Heavenly Falcon. Strike without warning like the hunter of the skies. 
Oh, it's a sword kit. Sure, why not? Yeah. It's got a big furry thing. Huh. Shiganori's rust. Wow. Look how many swords are around here. This dueling ring. Wow, learning this technique was like its own little thing. Cool. Very cool. And now we can come back whenever we want? Mm-hmm. Fine, I'll go to that, and then probably... Yeah, we've liberated four places now. I don't think I'm gonna obsess over it. Maybe? I don't know. Oh, but the other samurai was nearby too. But I think it's okay. Why don't we get this question mark and then go back to Lady Masako? Is she available? She is. Apparently there was a question mark right on the way here, but I missed it. Because we were so focused on this guy. <laughs> I almost feel like I should be going back to that musician to let him know that, hey, I got the technique now. Well, there's so many trees with white flowers here. White leaves. Here? Oh dear. Oh dear. There's still so much lightning strikes. Do you want to go up? is necessary yes it is for one flower whoa 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 no heck yeah flowers are valuable no we're not quite there just yet oh god oh god oh god oh yeah I thought that was not <laughs> oh well it is what it is. Oh, I don't know how much I like this furry thing. It's like a furry sword sheath. But you know, in the interest of trying new things and all that, it does match with my thing color-wise. I really do miss the Traveler's outfit though. Sometime. Once we can upgrade it. Well, I mainly miss it, not because of how it looks, but just because I wanna... Oh! Because I wanna find records and stuff. Yeah, animals we can't carry. Because they don't hold swords. Woo! Scary. Oh, we're getting further and further now. What is it? Another fox then. Okay. I think we needed one more fox for the charm slot. So this is perfect. There's some people over there. Oh, where'd the fox go? Oh no. Here. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. You leave me so fast. I can't even thank you. Good. Awesome. Mythic Tales. Seek out musicians to hear tales of legendary techniques and long-forgotten treasures. That's what we just did. Yup. Wow. Charm of Immunity? 15% increased resolve gains. Oh, this is... Yeah, this is not a chance. Let's go. Oh, okay. These slots are different. Minor charms? But all of my charms right now are minor charms, so I guess it doesn't really matter. 
Now, what were the people doing here? Mongol eagles have an eye in the sky. If their eagle sees you, it will alert nearby enemies. I did see it earlier, yep. If we kill the eagle, though, they're gonna know. <laughs> Feel horrible. I killed the eagle, just the eagle. <gasps> yeah, earlier we had a guy that had an eagle on him, too. Do you want to try some bombs and stuff? No? Oh god! Perfect strike! Oh. Hold still. Where did they capture you? My family's home on the Kashine shore. The Mongols turned it into a shipyard. They must be repairing their ships, getting ready for their next conquest. Stay away from there until I've killed them all. They capture peasants all the way in some location with nobody. I'm glad we got to save them. Okay, that's good. That's the place I added. A shipyard. Okay, let's get back to Lady Masako. Oh, we can't fast travel here. Oh, no, it's the estate. Yeah, we can go to the estate. Lady Masako, I really hope you didn't kill Hina. Lord Sakai. Lady Masako, has the traitor's wife told you where he's hiding? Every time I ask, she starts crying and won't look at me. Can you blame her? I'm starting to. <laughs> Maybe a young samurai will charm her. She's inside. <sighs> Wait here. Yeah, this is a side quest. My lord. Lady Masako plans to kill me. I can see it in her eyes. I won't let her hurt you. But I need your help. I have told you all I know. Hachi delivers messages for your husband. That means they have contact. It's only a matter of time until Masako finds them both. No, you have to save him. I can only do that if I get to him before she does. You know your husband. Where would he hide? Let me think. This is important, Hina. Your husband murdered innocents. I'll be back. You don't have all the time in the world to think. I do think Masako wants to kill her, though. Well... I'm giving her time to think about where he might be. What did you offer her? Let's take a walk. I know a place she won't hear us. You can't kill her, okay? I told Hina I would try to save her husband's life. You know I'm going to kill him. I had to gain her trust somehow. So you lied. I told her I would try to save him. And I will. What will you tell her when you fail, Jin? That you cannot forgive his crime. 
and that I would not stand between you and justice. Everywhere I look here, I see only the night my family died. When my father died, I didn't go home for a long time. An empty house falls apart quickly. This isn't my home anymore. It's where my family was slaughtered. Little hands still holding toys. My sister's gold sash wrapped around her butchered body. I can't protect anyone. I can only avenge them. Hmm. There should be music. What? My grandchildren would make songs with me here to celebrate the changing of the seasons. I will never hear them play again. Thank you. A tender moment. Leave me alone! Oh no. Get to the house. Are you serious? Oh, the husband's coming to kill her. Oh, but I gotta get the supplies. We got no, we gotta save her. Oh no. Oh no. Damn. Hina. We need her killer. Now. Better look around. Got in so quickly. They must have left a trail. This way. They can't have gone that far. They were on foot. Mm, they didn't turn this way. This way. Why would someone kill Hina? To keep us from finding Sadao. The traitors knew we had her. It was a long journey from the woodcutter. Many people saw her with me. You made sure they did. You used her as bait. I hoped her husband would take it. And now an innocent woman is dead. The traitors killed her, not us. But you made her a target. Yeah, this woman... I very much do sympathize with how her whole family died, but she is very much a the ends justify the means kind of woman. Much like the sort of internal struggles that Jin might have right now with the whole, oh, do I use assassin techniques or do I stick to the samurai way? Only one set of tracks. Whoever the killer is, they're alone. With Hina gone, we need them alive. They have our man. We can't let him die. If we can't let him die, then we gotta... I'm bleeding. Oh god, Hachi. Oh, just go in. Just go in. Cut too deep. Cut too deep. Oh. I don't want to go like this. Can I not throw a bomb? Did I even get anybody? Ouch! Ow! Good. Not today. Can I get my kunai back? Did Hashi die already? He's not talking. 
That's not good. Uh oh. No, not you. Hachi, Sadao's brother. Why did you kill Hina? Tried to free her. She wouldn't leave. Wanted to save Sadao. She screamed for you. I I didn't mean to. Where's your brother? I what? failed him. I won't betray him. You can't die! Tell me where he is! He's gone. No. Hina died for nothing. She was murdered by traitors, just like my family. I can't give up the hunt. That's insane! He carried messages for his brother. Maybe he had one. The brother-in-law came to rescue Hina. And she said, no, I won't leave. So he kills her accidentally? What? Was it even an accident? Oh. I just happened to see it this time. What did you find? Supply map stain in blood. A map belonging to Hachi, brother of Sadao, the headman of Kura Farmstead. It details the supply routes Hachi traveled. A map of supply routes. He delivered food to survivor camps. Maybe Sadao is hiding at one. Go to the nearest camp and talk to the monk in charge. He might know what the map reveals. What about you? I will bury Hina. I owe her that. I'll find you at the camp when I'm done. Yeah, she's not an emotionless woman. Especially now that Hina was killed. I feel like Masako feels like she can relate to her somewhat being betrayed by her family. Offensive charm. Attacks have 5% chance to deal double damage. It says attack on the plaque. Don't have room. A new gift. We're back in the cemetery. A traitor. We gotta go to the Ariake refugee camp. Oh, it's that one right there. Yeah, why don't we go straight there? I kind of just want to continue this right now. Masako said to find the monk in charge of this camp. He may be able to read the map I found on the traitor's brother. Lord Sakai. Junshin. How good to see you. Sure he was a That's the one that we saw at the Golden Temple before. Could have been any End this war, my lord. Do you know the tale of Tadayori, my lord? I know his name. But I've not heard of his exploits. It's long believed the Ama Tadayori war granted him great power. That it would be disastrous should it fall into the wrong hands. Then I can't let that happen. I'd like to hear more of this story. And this armor. The musician Yamato may be able to help. He told me the legend in Azamo, near the river that separates it from Sutsu. Same musician? Or the musicians traveling around. Oh, another one of these mystic tales. Anyway, may I assist you, my lord? We're here for the monk. Junshi, I should have expected to find you here. How may I serve you, my lord? Do you know these lands well? I set up all of these camps. Does this map mean anything to you? We give these to our wagon drivers who deliver food. They mark where the camps are so no one gets missed. Is that blood? Do you see anything that isn't one of your camps? I hear rumors of our own people killing each other in Ariake. Traitors are preying on innocent people. They murdered the women and children of Clan Arachi. You can help bring them to justice.
This map shows Ariake's lighthouse. We know it. We have no camps there, but people have said bandits have taken it over. Not bandits. Something worse. Lady Masako has arrived. I think she prefers to speak with you. One second, please. What have you learned? All my goods are useful. I have goods of all kinds. We have predator hides. Arrows. Yeah, more arrows. 12? Increasing the capacity to 12. Flaming arrow to 6. To six. Black powder bomb. Let's increase arrow capacity. An excellent choice. I'm sorry. I need more for that. Quick fire capacity. Linen. Yeah, okay, we can buy arrows here, but we don't need to. Thank you. May your Would you like to successful. see what I have? The headman of Kuta village might be at the lighthouse. Clan Adache built that for Ariake. This traitor has no shame. Sadao has men protecting him. There's no way they won't see us coming. Good. I want to give that traitor just enough time to fear what's coming. Let's go. I don't suppose we can fast travel to it? Yeah. Um... While that question mark is right behind us anyway, it's pretty close by. Can we get it? <clears throat> Another fox den. Where are you exactly? Have I passed you by? Here you are. Let's go quickly, little foxy. Sorry, Masako. I'm making you follow me on this trip. Sekai, come. Oh, I I'll be back very soon. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Spectacular landing. Thank you. Okay, okay, back to business. Probably Nobu would make this faster. Let's go. Sorry, Lady Masako, I'm I am back. Let's go. We have very good daylight here. Why would Sadao betray you? I accused him of stealing rice. Starving our people to turn a profit. You think he caused the rice shortages that hit Kuta? I could never prove it. But it was such a disaster. I knew he was trying to hide something. Bad men are good at hiding their true natures. That's right. Because they want to exploit you on purpose. Guards outside. The coward is hiding at the top. Sado! I've come for your head! Okay, I guess we're going in hot. Oh, I don't have any more bombs. That's fine. Oh, that would be so perfect with how many people are here, but I don't have any. Lady Masako? You all right? I can't even see! Oh, 
Thank you for turning your back on your enemy. Lots of archers. Those men, they're faltering because of the kunai. Fall off! Don't worry, I'm coming to get you. Lady Masako, are you all right? Die and fall. Masako. Oh my god, you're already you're rushed up ahead. Because of you! You should have died with your family! I wish I had! Damn you! You killed Sado. Masako. He helped kill everyone I loved. And for what? To satisfy his pathetic hatred? When the Mongols defeated the samurai, I wanted to die with them. I threw myself into a battle I knew I couldn't win. It was... easier. How do you survive? I remember that I have people to protect, and the dead to avenge. With Sado dead, whoever is responsible will hear that I'm alive and hunting. They'll become afraid, make a mistake. Just be careful, Masako. You too. You are a part of this now. We'll find the other traitors on that list. But first, we must save my uncle. I'll be at Kaneda Farmstead when you need me. That sounds like the end of this for now. We have to save our uncle first. We can't just do everything besides saving our uncle. Charm of Ferocity. Offense... Offense Charm? Moderate increase to melee damage. That sounds incredibly useful. Bonus damage while at 50% health or less. This seems good too. I want all of them. Knocking and reload speeds, you know what? I don't use a bow enough for that. Let's give this a go. Moderate increase of arrow damage. 15% increase of resolve gains. Let's try switching it with moderate increase to melee damage. Yeah, a more offensive kind of setup. We'll see. Warrior's Bounty. Yellow. Hey, it kind of goes well with my headband, too. Huh. Upgrade available for the Traveler's Attire. Hmm. Wanna go back to it? I do like it. When we get back to a shop. Oh! I accidentally switched my colors. Whoa, I feel very... royal. <laughs> 